Miss Young here. For this video, we will be reviewing songs number 17, 18, and 19 from your Essential Elements book, which cover the notes D, E, F, and G on your D string. Before we begin, let's go ahead and review those notes from our last video. So go ahead and think through that eek song until we get to our digging line, and we're going to find that open D string for digging. Very good. Go ahead and pluck that string when you find it, and then get ready to set up first finger E on the D string. Go ahead and put down first finger on the tape closest to the top of your instrument. We have our thumb right across from first finger, and remember it's halfway on the tan part and the black part, and then my wrist is nice and straight like we discussed last time. Nice straight wrist. Good. If we add a second finger, we will make F on the D string, and finally our third finger will make G on the D string. Very good, and all this time this pinky is just kind of hanging out up top above that fingerboard, so he's not hiding under here, he's also not in our way, he's just hovering over the fingerboard. Very good. Now if we take a look at song number 17 from our Essential Elements book, you can see that we are only going to use notes G, F, and E. So again we have three fingers for G, and here we can see our fingering chart to help us out. So we have three fingers down for G, two fingers down for F, and one finger down for E. Now before we give this one a try, let's simply go ahead and say the number of fingers that we will need for each of these notes before we try playing it. So we're just going to say it together this time, starting right here with our G. Ready? Finger numbers. One, two, Ready, here we go. Three, three, two, rest. One, one, two, rest. Three, two, one, two, three, 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 rest. Very nice. Let's go back to the beginning. Set up that third finger, G on the D string, and we'll give it a try together. One, Two, ready, here we go. G, G, F, rest. E, E, F, rest. G, F, E, F, G, 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 rest. Very nicely done. Let's go ahead and move on to song number 18 morning dance. Now this one's even trickier. We have some crazy things going on here. If you take a peek between F and D, we are actually going to skip E in between there. This is the first time we've seen a skip like this in a song. So we're going to go directly from two to no fingers. We're going to take both of those off the fingerboard at the same time. Let's practice that. Go ahead and play F on your D string and then take both fingers away and play D. Again, F, D, F, D. You got it. Otherwise, this song is following the same finger patterns that we've been learning with our uh, notes on the D string, D, E, F, and G. Let's give this one a try nice and slow, starting right on G. One, two, ready, here you go. G, G. F, D, G, G, F, D, E, E, F, F, G, G, G. Very good. That one's tricky. Go back and do that one as many times as you need to until you feel comfortable with that one. And finally, the last one I'd like to take a look at is... Number 19, rolling along, and a lot of you figured out that this is also called by another name. This is also Mary Had a Little Lamb, and in this one we're only going to go back to using three notes, F, E, and D, so we won't need our third finger for this one. F, E, and D. Go ahead, set up that second finger F. We have that thumb across from first finger. 
that nice straight wrist. Ready? One, two, ready, here we go. F, E, D, E, F, 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 Sh, E, 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 Sh, F, 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 Sh, F, E, D, E, F, 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 E, E, F, E, D. Excellent work. How many Fs? If we look at this line right here, how many Fs do we have in a row? Help me count. One, two, three, four Fs, and then followed by how many E's? Let's count. One, two. Let's try that just from right here to the end, starting back with those four Fs, those two E's, and finally F, E, D. Let's try that together. Four Fs, two E's, F, E, D. Ready? Here we go. F, two, three, four, E, E, F, E, D. And there you have it. Now you know how to play Mary Had a Little Lamb on your violin. Feel free to watch this video as many times as you need to until you feel comfortable with songs number 17, 18, 19. And I will be making another video for the songs on the next page 20, 21, and 22. Happy practicing!